What is going on guys? We are back out here at the shop right now because we have some fun stuff that we are going to be doing today. Going to be doing a little project in the shop and we're going to be ripping the rounds. Let, let, let me show you what we got going on here. We are going to be ripping it, sending it. Yep. We're going guys. to be doing a motor swap on this here unit of a go-kart. Going from a 212 to a 224. Hmm. And we're going to do a speed test, compare the two, see what we get out of the new engine compared to the old one. Yeah. And we're going to make the best of it, man. Oh, yeah. This go-kart's going to be a, a pretty cool project over the next matter of months. Uh, we're going to start by swapping the new engine on it here. It's got reverse now, too. <laughs> That's always how I have to back up or stick my feet on it's the outside of it. I like it. Yeah. But, yeah, everyone loves this, this little thing. It's just a fun little ripper and everything like that and it hasn't been running a lot lately um because well this engine's been running like crap last time you guys saw this out we were at mud bash and it would not stop stalling on me pull that lever real quick so it's good to see that there we go because what i want to see is the oil the saying has a lot of blow by on it and this oil has not been changed in forever because uh it never gets ridden so let's take a Look at this real quick. And I just put fresh oil on it, so you know. Oh yeah, that's nice right there. Mm -hmm. That's that. That's like. <laughs> that's what they call in the oil change in the community. They call it DOA. That is dark on arrival. <laughs> Holy mother of shit! I'll take her over from here, Mr. Full Throttle Cameraman here. Alright guys, uh, we made it out here to just the back road behind Audie's house. Uh, for, so the, we got the worn out 212 on it still and we're just going to, we're going to see, see how it does. Good, yep. And it doesn't have brakes, so let's, let's see what the top speed is. I'm going to let you use your speedometer first to see how fast I end up going and then, uh, then I'll turn mine on and see if it records it differently. Alright, here we go guys. Oh, come on, you used to be so much faster. I am really trying, guys. She is not going any faster. That was wide open. I got How much? 36. Oh yeah, way slower than before. It used to top out at 48. Mm. Alright guys, let's use my speedometer real quick. Oh, what? That engine's on the last leg. Right? Oh yeah, look at all the oil coming out of it. Yeah. Alright guys, my speedometer's on. Oh, it's set to kilometers. We don't want that. Car pass real quick. Good. All right, guys, here we go. Twenty six, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, and one, thirty two. Come on! Three, 
four. I got 34. I got 38. 38? 38. Well, I guess mine's a little off then. I only got 34 out of it, so. Well, guys, let's go ahead and rip this back to the house real quick and uh, let's start this engine swap. Look, guys, we're back from that little ride. The go kart did sit my, on my app, it said 34, but Audi clocked me going 38. But it's a lot slower than the 48 it used to do on the pavement, so. Yeah, and when we got back, this thing is just squirted oil everywhere. Oil everywhere, Bubba. This engine is done. Right out here. It's getting ready to freaking cut out on me here. Yeah, we're ready to start taking this thing apart off so I can get all this oil cleaned off here so I can yeah, get those easily bolts. get a socket on there without just slipping off. Yeah. And, uh, yep, guys. Got the engine here, brand new 224. And uh, and the reason it's already open is because I've already opened it to check on it. But yeah, brand new engine in the box. It's got all that stock stuff on it, which we'll probably keep on to do the break in for the engine before we uh, swap on the performance parts. But yeah, me and I are going to go ahead and uh, take this engine off real quick and uh, disassemble everything and then catch you guys in just a second when we get this. Engine well guys, uh, we have gotten all the engine mounts off, uh, disconnected all the wires and the throttle cable. This engine is ready to be pulled. We were fighting the stern up last. Look at this, uh, look at this, look at this stern washer now. The washer there is <laughs> not liking this whatsoever. <laughs> no, but we got it. Uh, I want to do the honors? I would love to do the honors, sir. Off she comes. Look at all of that gray and dirty oil residue. This thing is nasty. The Sarah off to the side. It's sometimes she sits at an angle. Got to take all that other stuff off of it anyway. That guy's got. We'll strip all the performance mods off of this one here, and we'll put them on this this new one here. Hey man. Yeah, here, hold this real quick. Big thing is going on. Just get this new one pulled out here. See what we got. All right, got an oil funnel. Got all your typical plastic and everything. Got guns. Pretty new engine right there. Shiny. Ah. Yep. Gas only. Yep, no diesel. No diesel. Nope. So well, guys, this is going to be the engine that we end up building out here. It is. And all these engines are, univer are pretty much universal, like you can run them all, all sorts of different ways beside that. Like, um, when I build this engine out, I probably won't record it. I recommend one channel you guys go check out, he builds all these engines, Redbeard's Garage. He's literally done every performance modification to any, any of these go-kart minibike engines you can buy, so I recommend checking him out. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, get this cleaned up here. We're gonna, get this ready to get broken in and then we'll catch you guys when we get ready to start running now. Well, Hottie, it's raining now. It is raining. It is uh, lightning very close by. Yeah, But it should be passing here soon, but that's why I brought brought my waders with me. Because, mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. But we got the, got the new engine put on. It's not completely secure yet. No, she's off. She's bumping on. This, yeah. She ain't tightened up yet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we're going to not put the performance mods on just yet, but I want to compare it as well with the stock engine to see if it's faster than the performed engine I was on it before. And, uh, yeah. But, yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Man, there better not be no darn tornado with all this wind. There ain't no worms or anything. But, yeah. You still have to hook up the wires and the throttle cable and stuff, but it's got a built-in throttle right now, so we'll just use that. And then, uh, it's got oil, it's got gas, so I'd say it's ready to fire up now. Let's do it. Come on, man. So, guys, it's firing her up. Uh, fuel is, uh, I actually turned off. Probably good. 
Yeah, it might. Kind of it might not be that bad. Ooh, about tripped on that uh, exhaust. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, give it a pull. Yeah, guys uh, we have finished hooking up the engine now uh, um, not in, I mean we had to do a little modification here don't mind uh, that just hanging right there it's just a tail yeah that's a tail yeah. <laughs> it's just hair damn but but yeah um, engines on it's ripping really good uh, there we go I'd torque is there oh yeah it's definitely got that extra torque and you, and you can feel that for sure it's bone stock uh, we just gotta go out and do a couple more half throttle three quarter throttle poles on it and then uh, then we'll go ahead and open it up and take it see what the top speed is with a bone stock to the bone stock edit. Yep. And then we'll add modifications. Mm -hmm. Yep, we're gonna take the stage one kit off the old engine and uh, we're gonna throw it on this one here and uh, we'll see if see if we can achieve forty eight or even faster miles per hour. Go for fifty. Yeah, going for fifty. In uh, fifty plus? Yeah well on the high look we can't go above fifty five so <laughs> Yeah. Well, guys, we're gonna go ahead and uh, go finish doing a couple of these pulls here, and then we'll go ahead and catch you guys when we got the GoPro on. Well, guys. Okay. Yeah, we're we're back at got the GoPro out here. We already did a couple. It was supposed to be three three quarter throttle pulls on it, but it, we just went ahead and went wide open on it. It, it tops out the, about the same, but we're gonna do do like two more two more passes, and we're gonna see. I'm gonna turn on my app here. Here and we're gonna see how fast it goes now. It keeps on resetting the kilometers. Alright guys, here we go. I'm wide open right now. This is bone stock 224. Here we go. How fast was that? I got 39. 39? 34. Is that 39? Yeah. Okay. I, I believe that one a little more. Alright, let's do one more run back and then let's go for on that performance kit. Wide open, here we go.
That was just oil. Oh, it's done. It's done. It's done. <laughs> Oh my god! The bunk destroyed! Oh, and the clutch is stuck too. Oh. Oh, no. oh, I just felt that thing hit my back so hard. That's alright, man. It'll be okay. Uh, now I'm gonna have to come back tomorrow. Yep. Oh, and it's wrapped the fuck up in there yeah, too. Wrapped. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, I just felt that thing hit my back. Oh, that's alright, man. It'll be okay. Oh, now I'm gonna have to come back tomorrow. Yep. Oh, and it's wrapped the fuck up in yeah, there. Yeah, it's wrapped up in there. We're gonna have to, uh. Alright, boys, guys, knife still. Let's go, go, go grab it and cut it off. This is fucking. Something's fucked up here. The clutch. Something, something happened with the clutch. It's very hot shit. Well, guys, we broke it. Well, it's broken. <laughs> there it is. Good, good news is, is that I got another belt back home, but I don't have it on me right now, yeah. so. Well, let's go ahead and get this old yeah, one cut. By this house, there was a little boy on the porch just holding his ear shut when yeah. I was riding by. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the get a belt. I see it. Get out of the room, man. That's crazy. Well, that's broken. Shredded. Yep. Shredded. Well, guys, I guess we'll catch you back at the house. Well, guys, we are back at the shop. Uh, I broke, uh, you officially say I broke it in. <laughs> yeah, literally. Yeah, the belt. Something else is, the belt didn't just break, something else just broke. As you can see, the driver, the, the primary clutch is stuck way past full throttle, and so something's broken in there. But yeah, yeah, that's. This is yeah. The, uh, Carnage. And that belt was brand new looking before we even went out on this ride. Now, 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 off camera, it did come, start coming apart and started smacking me in the back with one of the little threads. So we cut that off and then and, uh, did one more wide open pull and it, and it blew apart. So, so, so I have a feeling because it wasn't doing this before I put this, this primary back on. I have a feeling something was going on in the primary because I rem remember I said, uh, said how, how, how it was going and then all of a sudden it just kicked in. Yeah. So I have a feeling that the primary was actually slowly grabbing, so, and then it just all of a sudden kicked in. So we probably weren't getting an accurate speed test yeah. either. I mean, Audi said that, 39? 39. 39. 39. Yeah. It, could, it could be faster, it could be slower, who knows, yeah. but something obviously uh, is wrong with this right here, so. We're gonna get it fixed. Yeah, we're gonna get it fixed. Got or some new parts now, and then we're gonna come back and uh, gonna throw on the stage one kit. And we're gonna do it again. But I mean, the hard part was is uh, getting that throttle cable yeah, figured out. The throttle was a pain. Yeah, that's why it's now nighttime. We spent like a few hours messing with the with the throttle cable. Every time we hit the, hit the pedal in for the throttle, it gets stuck back here. Yeah. But now, you know, a little <laughs> bit of spring action, you get it done. Yep. But yeah, guys, I think we're going to just go ahead and wrap it up here. I got some parts to order now, and uh, I, let's just say that yeah, we're going to come back and this thing should hopefully do 50. That's that's what we're hoping for. If we can achieve 50 with that kit, then I'm happy. But obviously, uh, dry primary is broken. So. Yep. All right, Good guys. Luck. It's been a blast today, and yep. we will catch you all on the next one. Peace out.